<coughs> some of these are going to sound strange because uh, I used to do the tour of all the PRSSA chapters back when I was head of student liaison and then I became president of PRSA. And I used to visit all the schools, not only in the Philadelphia region, but outside in, in New York and Delaware. Uh, and I would always want to talk to sophomores and juniors because if I'm talking to seniors, they've already made the mistakes that I can't correct. Uh, but So let me just tell you what I told them and you guys can figure out if you're there or not. Uh, you know, first off, we're looking for obviously anyone who's done well in school, who has a major that is relevant to what I'm looking for, uh, has had some internships, and it doesn't mean you have to have it from an agency. I don't care if you've had two internships at agencies, you could have had two at nonprofits, you know, one at a corporate, one at somewhere else, it doesn't really matter. I just want to be able to see that you've actually worked in an environment where you understand what the real world is like, you, you've had some writing opportunities and, and, and those kinds of things. But you know, resumes across the board, you know, for the most part are going to look similar. So then I look for tiebreakers. And tiebreakers to me in the agency world are, what kind of a presenter are you? Now, I can't necessarily tell that out, you know, from looking at your resume. But I used to tell folks, well, if I saw that you were on the debating team, that tells me that you know how to state a position or defend a position. And if you want to grow in the agency world, you grow through basically two things. You have, obviously have to be a good practitioner, but you grow through being able to do new business. And to do new business, you have to stand in front of a group and make presentations. So I want to be able to get some kind of an idea that you understand that and you know how to make presentations.